everybody and welcome back to Willow Wire. Today we are playing Gremlins on the Game Boy Color. Now, I know nothing about the game, but I've seen the movie when I was a kid. There's a game link for this. Merry Christmas, Billy. <laughs> Let me introduce Gizmo. Be careful. There are three rules you have to follow. Number one, you must n keep Gizmo out of the light. Number two, keep Gizmo away from water. And the most important thing, don't ever feed Gizmo after midnight. Billy did not notice that the Mogwais have modified the time on his alarm clock. So I can play as either Gizmo the Mogwai or Stripe the Gremlin. Interesting. I'm going to do two save states. We'll do a save state on zero, and we'll do a save state on five. So let's go back to zero. Oops. We'll go with Gizmo first. Billy's house. What? What is that? Oh, it's a camera. Uh, I wasted most of my shot. Okay, maybe I should reload that. <laughs> Alright, let's not waste our camera shots this time. Wow, his jump. He's like a little pig. What even was that? I have no idea what that was. Oh, I can climb on the wreath. Oh, they're, they're film. They're little film canisters. Ow! I got Mogwai. I can't even climb the curtains. I have no idea what that was. Oh, ouch! Ouch! I can't move. Ouch! Whoa, what's happening? Oh, I see what's happening. Hang on. There we go. I tried to take a picture in the air. It didn't work. Well, that didn't work out very well. I did it. Okay, so I gotta recollect everything. Basically, stay off the floor. Why is everything so big compared to me? Like, I know he was small, but was he really this small? Oh, oh really? Oh, jumping on their heads doesn't hurt me. I just have to make sure they don't catch me. Wait, what's this? Oh, it looked different for some reason. I look like a little pig bat. These dresses are huge. Oh, I fell. Uh-oh. Did I get him? Oh, I can't get over that. Well, at least I got him. I thought I could go through the drawers. I guess I can't. Sunglasses! What is my goal? 
Like, it hasn't told me anything that I'm supposed to be doing. Do I have to kill them too? Ow. Stop climbing things! Stop climbing things! Most games, you wish they would climb better. This game, it's all like, can you just not climb anymore? Another heart? Oh, another life. Trying to go down, not up. I was hitting the button, but it wasn't going. Okay, he wasn't even facing me. Ooh, that almost got me. It's not working. Oh, I can change my weapons! Alright, now you're going down, little man. Apparently he wants to hide now. Wish I would've known about that before. Wow, really? That was close. So those little firecracker looking thingies are actually arrows. I can see it now that I'm actually looking at it. Run away! I tried to jump, but the reactions in this game are so slow. Got him. health right about now. Got him. Stop climbing everything. Oh, I can go in the chimney. Well, that's unique. It would have been nice for it to have, uh, you know, told me that. Instead of making me guess. Well, hey. I've got a whole new area now. It's just kind of floating there. Got him. get past that. Oh, that's not what I wanted to... Okay, so I've been playing this for about half an hour. I even looked up what you're supposed to do. But I'm having no luck. So, what you're supposed to do is not kill all the gremlins. You're supposed to go and uh, find all of the specific item that Gizmo was looking for. In this case, it would be sunglasses. And that's how you get to the end of the level. Well, I've searched this entire level again and again. And I can't seem to find any sunglasses anywhere. I've already got four. And there's no doors opening. There's nothing like... I Like I said, I've explored this again and again. There's no gremlins left to worry about. So I was able to just run back and forth through everything. I do have one spot that I can think of. That maybe I could go take a quick look at before I fully give up. But if it's not there, then I really don't know where it would be. I believe I gotta go upstairs for it. Okay, I found the area in which I missed. There's even gremlins here. That stupid staircase just completely eluded me. Like, really? Look, there's even an extra life over here. Is there anything up here? Yep, some arrows. 
I had to jump over that bookshelf after the staircase, and I had never really thought to do it, because I did it the first time before I had died. I guess I'll just kill off all the gremlins as a uh, bonus. Oh, I can go through that. I haven't been this far. Here's I'm gonna have one hell of an edit for this one. Oh, fudge. Yay, I did it. Like this game, now that I've done it for as long as I have and figured out that you know you can, you win Pete Pocket. Huh, well, I wonder what that means. Uh, hey look, we got a password, it's really blurry. Uh, but yeah, it's not that hard now that I know you can go and switch through weapons and stuff. Alright, the school laboratory. Oh, man. Window. Oh, I can climb the wall. Yeah, the description, all it said was that you can attack them using your camera. But in reality, I use my bow more than my camera. There we go. I like to take the high route first. Ouch. I would much rather help at this point. Like, once you know where they are, it's not that hard. Oh, I should probably save. I don't know what happens when you die. No, oh, I didn't mean to drop. Ah, oh, fudge. Okay. I want to take him out. Got him. Hey, look, a candy. It was worth it. I missed that one. Ooh. Got him. Ooh. Well, I got the sunglasses in the end. Hey, you're a medicine cabinet. Why aren't you giving me any medicine? Medicine in the form of candy. Candy is dandy. Get that yet? Oh, I got it anyway. <laughs> Might need that later. Let's grab it now. Wow, I already got four sunglasses. We keep landing on all the candy. That was close. We his jump is outrageous. Taking out all the upper levels. Hey, sunglasses. Wow, that was an easy level. I didn't even see the bottom of the level at all. Don't explore, just take the top route. I won, chef. I don't understand what this winning thing is. Says Legend of Zelda Wind Waker. Oh, I see. Uh, let's see here. Okay, that's on the right side, so I need to get this one over there. Okay. And this one needs to go over there. There used to be a method to this, but I can't fully remember how it worked.
Okay, I see it. That's a creepy one. These ones are going to slow this gameplay down massively. Oh my god, he's all green. I need to find the headpiece. I think that's an ear. So where's his other side? That is, okay. That one to go first. Oh, come on now. How many of these is going to make me do it once? Right. So that's one of the top pieces, that's one of the top pieces. those two to be there and I need that one to be where it is so that means I need that one goes last that one goes first Switch it around. There we go. But now I gotta get them. Ugh. time. Wait, that's a loss? You lose? There ain't no way that was a loss. Yeah! 
You lose? You lose all of that and you lose to a puzzle game. A puzzle game. Are you kidding me? There. Did it. Holy cow, that took me three tries. The swimming pool. Not sure how long this game is, but damn. Oh, what the? That was cheap. Ouch. Me. Holy crap. They're so abrupt in this one. Well, I know now not to go near those. jump right up to that. There we go. Another one down. Oh, I can climb the pipe. Oh, there's one pair. I wonder if I can go up there. Oh my. Uh-oh. I broke gizmo. There we go. Don't go up there. You break gizmo. We So much film. I have a 99 film. <laughs> Stripe. I don't need any more of that. Two down, three to go. Uh, he didn't grab the pipes like I thought he would. That's what you get. Ooh, health. I'll go in there after I check out this other area. Check all these areas first. I was pressing the button, but it wouldn't go. Why does he have to be so complicated? I just wish the buttons were more responsive. See where this takes me. Kinda. I like how I could just jump right through the pipe. I don't even want to think about what's probably down there. See, there's an area I haven't been to up there so far. Oh, there's another pair. Two more to go. I don't know why I thought that was going to be something I could stand on. It was quite clearly a wall tile. It's a closed bin. Man, Gizmo, you're slow. Is this pre or post Rambo Gizmo?
Now, there's also not a lot of story behind this. I knew if I waited, you'd come back out. Full health. That won't last long. Oh, I didn't see any of the glasses, so let's go ahead and go in. Where does this one go? I don't believe I've explored the floor too awful much so far. Ooh, another life. Save. Dead end. Oh, there's another one. Just need one more. Ow. give you so much ammo. It's like they knew that the aim was bad. And that gizmo slides everywhere. Woo, another level down. It was a very slow start, but hey, it's going pretty good now. And I won Archie. Are these the different gremlins or something? I really don't know what it means. The restaurant. I don't remember there being a restaurant. I could be wrong. It's been years since I've seen the movies. Oh, that was a fast one. We. I can walk on fans. I like how this game is promoting Rambo Gizmo. It's like once you find out that you can be Rambo Gizmo, you never go back. They give you all this film, it's all like, <laughs> I don't need your film. Probably run out of film eventually, I'll bet. I don't see anything up there. Man, why has it got to be so slow? Well, it gave me candy at least. Saw something. Pool balls? Why are there pool balls? In what world would the pool balls be moving on their own? I know that Gizmo's a Christmas horror movie and all, but... I don't, in any reality of Gizmo, see it as being a ghost-related one. Gotta be one over here. Oh, I can climb the shelves. Sort of. I can I can crouch in the shelves. This is probably gonna be one of those stages where they're actually on the floor to go and trip you up a bit. Oh yeah, you're going you're gonna, to you're gonna find them all on the top, like all the other levels, and then not one of them be on the top. Well, one of them was on the top, but yeah. That's my guess, though. I'm not really finding anything. I can walk in a picture. Oh, there's one. Well, there's two up top, I guess. I like the... Ooh. I like to do the top first, to get the upper parts out of the way, and then go down below, 
to see if I can find the ones on bottom without getting killed by the uh, gremlins. Because I know if I take out the top gremlins first, then if I do any high jumps or anything, I don't have to worry about hitting them. And the floor ones seem to be harder. So if I get rid of the top ones and I know where there's candies or whatever, I can just go back for them. That was everything on the bottom. Yeah, this stage kind of forces you to do the top first. Or bottom first, I mean. There are fans up here, though. Can I get on this? That was close. Yeah, there's one. Glad I went back and checked. Alright, now we'll check out over here. That was close. There. Ah! Fudge, I didn't realize how close I was to that. Can I go in there? No. Okay, so I'm past the Christmas tree, so let's go in here. We only got two more, so can't have that much farther. I like how they directed this game towards kids, for the most part, but the movie was so not PG. At least I don't find it to be PG. Probably the like least scary horror movie you can get, but truth be told, when I was a kid, it didn't so much, like the movie itself didn't scare me, but there was, oh look at that, one more to get, uh, but there was one part of the movie that left a lasting impression for a very long time. It is the silliest thing. There's a part in the movie where they're in the mall, I think it's a mall or a convenience store or something, and they got that song playing, Do You See What I See? And ever since I heard that song in that scene, like the whole movie had no effect on me whatsoever, no fear, no nothing. But ever since I saw that scene, that song just kind of creeps me out now. Extra life. I think there's a way to get. Yeah, there is. But I wonder how to do it. There we go. Oh! I can shoot so much faster when I'm crouched. I wonder if it works that way when you're normal crouched. Gizmo's just nonchalantly walking around, going and shooting everything. Just like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Another one down. Ramrod. These passwords are bizarre. The boiler room. This one's got some creepy music to it. Oh, that doesn't look safe. Oh my god, I can jump through that. That's horrible. Oh, I can climb that. Got him. There is nothing over here. What a waste of time. A be is that a wasp? Are they attacking? Oh, come on now. Now I gotta fight wasps? I like how the music just went from being like chaotic and almost scary sounding to kind of playful. Man, I hate those jumps. No, I ain't starting over from scratch. Uh-uh. That's just ridiculous. 
It takes all your camera shots. It takes all your arrow shots. That is ridiculous. But now I know not to go up. I can climb that. If this one, I'm better off starting on the bottom. Gizmo, stop being so dang slow. Trying to be careful with my upper jumps. Oh, there's another thing here. Okay. There's so many gremlins. Yeah, I'm gonna stay down here. Didn't see that coming, did ya? Even though I jumped off your head. So technically you probably should have seen it. There's one. Yay, full health. No, wasps. Reminds me of Donkey Kong. Why does it gotta take him so long to pull the trigger? Are you kidding me right now? Hey. Freaking pattern he has. Ow, I'm gonna die from the freaking wasp. There, I got it. No. Ugh. Didn't get me that time. Got that one. health. I go down this time. Got another one. So far so good. Nope. Can't go any further this way. At least I don't have to worry about them if I fall. Just gotta worry about this stupid wasp. Got it. Scared to move forward. Whoa. Ow. Got him. I got healed. There is literally nothing here. There was no reason to come here. No. Okay, well I got two. Got him. come back. They always come back. Another be down. There we go. We've already checked up there. Ooh, that was close. Hey. 
Got him. Another couple enemies down. Gotta say, the music to this game is kind of atrocious. I get it as Game Boy and all, but damn. It's bad. It gets on your nerves after a while. Two candies and I don't even... Three candies and I don't need them. Hmm. Because I got no choice but to go back. Because that's what I want to do. Okay, I think that's everywhere as I can go here. Yep, that's everywhere as I can go here. Alright, so now we'll go back up. We only found two sunglasses so far. The stage isn't even that big. Can't remember if there was a... Uh, a passage on that floor or not. That was close. There's a pair. They made these ones hard. They're all like, yeah, they've had it too easy up till now. Gotta change it up. Throw some wasps and, ooh, oh, okay. Throw some wasps and, ow. Some unseeable enemies. Some electric floors that we force them to go towards. Well, there's nothing down here. Just a gremlin. Just a lone gren gremlin being a butt. <laughs> no, if you're going for the goal of taking everything out, boom, there you go. Alright. Ow! I tried to duck, it was too late. Run away! Ow! Misjudged that horribly. Okay, whatever. Candy! Ow! The roof killed me. Whenever you see a stage offer a gazillion candies, you know there's a problem. You know it's about to get real after you start seeing all that. Ah, I was trying to be clever about it. It wasn't very clever. I got one hit left. There we go. Well, let's see where this goes. Still got two more to go. I don't have much luck. Wait, isn't this the beginning of the stage? Pretty sure it is. Alright, well, I know I saw a passage somewhere. Just gotta figure out where it was. There it is. Hey, the creepy music's back. And yay, we got more floor zappies. Everything's directing me up. Oh, let's see what's all the way up. Lots and lots of floor zappies. Okay, this is as high as it goes. What's that? Sweet! Okay, that was worth it. 
Even if there wasn't any sunglasses, I got an extra heart. Yeah, that's a pair. One more. I was trying so hard to get off of that pipe and it just wouldn't go. More arrows. Can't reach it. Why is he so slow? Okay, I just gotta get one more pair of glasses before anything hits me two more times. Well, technically three. it somewhere? There. I think I've taken out all the enemies now, except for that one bee. Oh, we'll climb up here then. We already went up that one, I'm pretty sure, but I don't think we went to the right. I think we only went to the left. So let's see what's to the right. Well, actually, we can still go up higher. gonna get hit there. There there. Just need to get a really good jump. Got it. There. Whew. That one was a tough one. Fix her up. Butterman's Garage. Alright, we're going to end this here. I've been playing this for almost an hour and 20 minutes now because of that first level. Um, plus, we still have the rest of this guy's story and we have the rest of Stripe's story as well. I might get more out of this than I thought. I also thought this was going to be a pretty quick game. But, you know, I'm, I'm kind of at a crossroads with this game. Like, do I like it? Do I not like it? Like, I'm at a 2.5 right now. After you learn the controls, it's actually not that hard. And it does have a password system, so you can keep going back. But that one slider stage, oh, that was just annoying. Can you imagine being a kid and being stuck on that? And that's the only reason you can't progress, because of that slider stage? Like, not all kids are good at puzzles. That's just ridiculous. So, like, I don't know. I think I'm at a 2.5 out of 5 right now. I would give this, like, a... I'd give this a strong C, currently. I want to see how much longer this goes on and how the uh, stripe side goes first. But I hope you guys have enjoyed this. If you have, hit that like, subscribe button. I'll catch you all in the next episode. Bye!